Hey, what's going on? This is Big Grime with FreeBigGrimeBeats.com, and I got Sonar 7. I'm going to show you how I use loops as my own and give it my own groove to them. I don't really like using loops too often, but if I do, this is how I use it, and I think I suggest everybody else to use it this way too. Um, some people use loops, and they just use it as it is and just add it, you know, their own stuff to it but uh I, I try to do things a little differently especially or you cannot just do it to like loops that you buy on sample libraries um like sometimes i make a beat and i don't really like the beat but the, i like the drums or i like the percussion i like something i did with it so i save it and i put it in a folder so that way i can use it in the future and um and i do that to these loops as well so let's say um for an example i have my Proteus VX, which if you don't have it, um, it's ridiculous not to have it. Um, it's a free VST. It's like a like a romper, you know, or like a just a sound module basically. And I made this patch. It's an e piano. Um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna play that pattern, and then uh, I'm gonna apply that groove to some drums that I have. All right, so let me go ahead and do that and I'll show you what I mean. Okay, so I I did my uh, piano and I imported my drums. My drums is a little short, so what I did is uh, just copy it over to make it one long thing. And uh, instead of having two clips, I'm gonna combine them. Bounce the clip. There we go. So now what I want to do is apply the groove on this piano to the drums. And what I will do is go to the uh, MIDI. I will copy it. It has to be MIDI. Copy it. And then I go to the, my drums and right click on it and go to Audio Snap. I just go to Audio Snap uh, Enable. This should pull up. And then you see Groove Quantize. And if you look, it says Clipboard. It says groove files says clipboard and that's basically what you copy the mini all right i'm just gonna hit okay and if you look it moves my drums a little bit and now this is what it sounds like
and you see how it changed the drums like it kind of hesitated a little bit at certain points is because of how I played it and I played it differently at first at the beginning of the, of the piano loop than I did at the end so that's why the drums are a little different but that's how I use my drums and and sometimes what I do is uh I'll go on let's say YouTube when I record you know a Quest Love drum solo and I record it into sonar and then I actually um at MIDI I, I pull up a MIDI track and then what I do is I copy how he did his drums. And I'm not really trying to get the same drum sound. I'm really trying to just get his groove. And what I do is I um, use the piano roll. I punch in the MIDI. And um, and then once I get that, then I copy the MIDI and then apply it to drums. And I'm going to tell you, I've gotten some amazing uh, amazing results. I mean, you got different. You can adjust the sensitivity on it. You can do different things, you know, to get the sound that you that you want or look for. Sometimes you just don't get. Sometimes it's like you get a sound that you really wasn't looking for, but it's like amazing. You know, a lot of times amazing music are made by accident. All right, so um, that's how I use it to apply grooves to my drums or any sound, percussions or really any sound. Um, just to let you know, I was using the Proteus VX, and this is one of my piano sounds I'm going to come out with. This will come with a kit called um, Dream Keys, and um, you can purchase that for $4. It's not out yet. It's still in the works, but this is one of the sounds that come with it. And, I mean, these keys sound very beautiful. I worked really hard on them. It's, it's ridiculous how they sound. I love them. All right, so just make sure you check me out free biggroundbeats.com and um. Or you check me out on myspace.com backslash big grime one. You don't have to spell it out. Just type number one. And just hit me up with comments, you know, questions or anything like that. If you got any questions about the new piano set I'm coming out with, please hit me up. Because um, I'm telling you that the sounds is going to be crazy on it. If you have the Proteus VX, even if you don't have it, you need to go get it. And then check out my sound packs. Um, I have a link that's going to be on there to my new Yahoo group. So you join the Yahoo group. I also put free sounds. Matter of fact, this piano, e-piano, is actually in my group that you can get for free. Just this piano. Because I'm going to put out demo sounds for the pack. And then if you want to get it, you purchase the pack. If not, you just keep the free sounds. All right? Peace.